All right, what you see is what we started with on our patina project. So let's go over it one more time, what we did. We went ahead and sprayed it with our three coats of copper paint, which sealed the metal so it ain't going to rust. We then went over it with our patina accent, indoor-outdoor, which goes with our patina spray paint. Then we came back over it and we used our patina sponge kit okay, on it. Now there's actually two more colors that go with this kit. These are the only ones I use though. And as you see, it's a vintage, antique, rustic looking piece and it looks like it's made of copper. Okay. Now the only thing that we have to do now is clear coat that. I will come back and clear coat it as soon as it dries in about 30 minutes and it's headed over to my house in my house and my computer table will be set up. So we'll get a good look. If you look real close, the spot welds that I put on there, if you look right in there, okay, they are hidden in there, but they are attention to detail. It's very, very small. Now, for all you guys that uh, can't find my signature anywhere, okay, I'm going to show you. All right, the reason I did this on this angle iron here is because the, it actually shows the table fits inside here. And Minnie uh, was giving me shit about how ugly it looks, so I decided to go ahead and put this scrolling. So you come on down. Now look real close and tell me if you can find the year that I made it and, and my initials. Uh oh, what's that right there? PJH 10 1 0. Okay, that means 2010. Because we didn't make it in 1910. So everybody knows that. So I'm thinking it came out really nice. I like it. Uh, it looks good. And it was a big job that I didn't really have time to fuck with because I got a lot of work to do. So uh, there you go. We'll let it dry for about an hour. We'll come back, clear coat it, and uh, take it home tomorrow. I need to find somebody to help me bring that fucking 125 pound. Anyway, I can't lift it up. All right. There you go, just another fragment of your imagination at work. Something that you can do yourself. Something that you can think of and say, wow, I did that all by myself. Just like turning that fucking microphone around. Okay, so this is Pete. We got our artwork done. It's looking good, I like it. Okay. Ah, there we go. And uh, that was a nice weekend project. I will clear coat it and take it home, and we will get a good look at it up inside the wall, okay, to see what it looks like. And it really does look nice. I mean, so use your imagination, take your time, think about it, okay. And when you're doing a project like this, uh, the best way to do it is always be thinking about the project as you're working on it. Ah, let me see if I can get, there we go. Always be thinking about the project as you're working on it. Even when you're sitting at lunch, think about it. What can you do to make it look different? What can you do to add to it? When you go to bed at night, think about your projects. Uh, when you wake up in the morning, think about it, you know? That's the only way things are gonna get done is if you put your mind to it and think about it. There it is, right there. Okay. It was easy to me. Maybe I make it look easy, but in a way it was hard, okay? Because to do this job, to make it easy, you have to use your brain. You have to think about it. Get her done, do it right, and do it all the way. We'll talk to you later. This is Pete. Don't give up. You will get it done one day. Okay, here we are, we're at home with the table, just like I promised everybody. 
and our buddy Steve here, Volkswagen Steve, coming to you guys, Steve, Bruno, he just got back. So there's my old computer table. Oh, and here, two weeks old. Okay, in comes the new table. Two weeks old? Yeah, we went and bought it over at Ikea. It didn't last long. Huh? No. You know how Ikea is, but it's cheap shit. It is cheap shit. Some of their stuff's okay, but their okay, desks and tables. You're going to have to hold that door, man. The door, we got to go in the angle. Go ahead. It's all right, it'll roll around. It's in there. What the fuck? What was that? <laughs> No. What's that? It'll fit, dude. Thank goodness it's made out of really hard metal. It'll probably chip the brick. Let's just not do that with the uh the glass. The Watch the glass. <sighs> okay, so we got our frame and it's looking nice. It actually goes good with our green walls that many painted green. It is green. It's green, believe me. Okay, so come on, go Steps ahead. Up Let's again. go. Go ahead of us. Watch your feet slick. Go ahead of us, baby. Okay, okay. Watch your car, Why not sure I'm glad I'm not a marble installer? Oh shit, just think about it, man. They get the, the pieces that are like 10 feet long. Thank God you came over Steve because I didn't think I could carry that. Now, watch your fingers, bud. Just set it down in there, right there. Slide it in easy. And there you go. Awesome! <sighs> what do you think of that? My friend Steve, your friend Steve, everybody's friend. It ought to be sturdy. What the hell, dude? I'm just checking. You gotta check. <laughs> Last thing you want to be all typing in them. Right? It that crush your legs. Are you fucking joking? You think I'm that cheap of a fucking... What dude. the fuck, dude? Okay. Well, Pete, that looks really Grab nice. Grab that end. It's gotta come over. Look, look. look at here, dude. It's off by three centimeters. Let's do it right there. Perfect. I think pretty sweet. Like it, dude? Now, anybody out there that wants a table made, don't fucking call me. Oh no, call us. We'll make you one. Right? How do you like the little shelves there, bud? So I like them. See, if you if, if somebody like for me with my desktop, I would want it square so I can put my computer on it. Oh, we'd make, make it. We make a custom table for Steve. Folks like it, Steve. That'd be cool because the air get to the bottom instead of having to set so it on Steve's the ground. Steve's already getting an idea. He wants to go look for marble over at Lessons. Yeah. At the Granite Shop. What's the name of Les's place? The Granite oh, Shop. My desk is inside my closet. <laughs> I already built it. I, pr I custom built mine inside the closet. Okay, so now Minnie has to wash that top down so we can transfer all our computer stuff. All right, this is Sammy Salami's editing room. See, this is it. You're looking at it. Sammy from Miami. Sammy from Miami's editing room, you know, right I here. I think he was here last night. Yeah, well, that bastard better not wake me up. Okay, we'll see you later. Take it easy. Thank you very much, Steve. Go home. Take Thank care you, of your baby. Steve. I muchly appreciate it. No problem, it. man. I know that's a pain in the arse. No, no. There you go. No problem. Goodbye. Oh, Bruno, yeah. thanks for all your help, buddy. You were a big supervisor on that job. My friend T, your friend T, best chest T, here we go again to learn some more stuff from you know who. Charlie the Cloud is here to stay. And my friend T, your friend T, best chest T, gonna show you how to do it right. <laughs> Hee <laughs>